Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Will Henderson. And uh, in this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to make your own hand sanitizer to fight against bacteria, germs, and uh, all that uh, great stuff. So uh, just gonna get right to it. Um, these are the ingredients here laid out in front of me. I got the 91% uh, isopropyl alcohol or rubbing alcohol. You can also use the 70%. Uh, they recommend that, uh, I believe the CDC says that anything above 65% is effective uh, to fight against germs and bacteria. I uh, also got a banana boat, uh, soothing aloe vera gel here. And I have tea tree oil. Uh, you don't necessarily have to use tea tree oil yourself. You can use any other essential oil uh, just for the fragrance uh, for your hand sanitizer. So we'll go ahead and uh, get to making it and we'll see that it's going to get a nice good consistency like this here that I made earlier on some blue colored uh, banana, banana boat uh, aloe vera gel. You can pick these little containers up like this. Uh, they're three ounce bottles. Uh, you can get them from CVS, Walmart, Walgreens. Uh, they have the flip tops, which are here. And then uh, we also have the uh, uh, spray tip bottles. So we've got those like that, as well as the spray bottles here. And these are probably about a dollar a piece. Uh, the alcohol here is about a dollar. The uh, banana boat uh, uh, aloe vera gel here is a few dollars, probably about four or five bucks. And the tea tree oil or any other essential oil, they'll vary. Uh, but this, I believe, was 11 bucks, but it's a large supply of them. Uh, so the consistency uh, is going to be uh, uh, kind of like I, I compared to Bath and Body Works consistency. Uh, have a quite a, uh, like a thick uh hand sanitizer as opposed to like a real watery down type so the uh makeup is going to be uh two-thirds of whatever your total batch is is going to be your alcohol uh one third is going to be your aloe vera gel and you're only going to need a couple drops of your essential oil so in this case i'm going to make one cup so in that one cup two thirds of the cup is going to be the alcohol. One third of the cup is going to be the aloe vera gel. And I'm only going to use two drops of the tea tree oil here. So uh, the other items I have here is a measuring cup. I have a one third of a cup measuring cup. And I have a spoon here. Or you can just use any other instrument to stir up your mixture. So I'm going to go ahead with the aloe vera gel and we are going to make, excuse me, <laughs> so this is going to be one third of a cup and you got about here and just squirt what you need in the cup and you can use your spoon or whatever utensil you have to so to stir it around and see how even you can make it. So that's about a third of a cup there. Now we're going to use our measuring cup here as well as the rubbing alcohol. And we're going to put two thirds of a cup. So this is one and two. Okay. We got our alcohol in there. We got our aloe vera gel. Now we just need a couple drops of the tea tree oil. Okay, a couple drops there. Probably a little bit more, but that's okay. And we got our spoon here. And we're just going to stir that up. So initially, while you're stirring this, is going to be uh, kind of like oil mixing with water. You'll see like the difference in the uh, aloe vera gel as well as the alcohol. 
And depending on how much oil you put in your mixture, the solution appears cloudy at first. Give that a couple minutes, that cloudiness will go away. And for more thickness in your hand sanitizer, use more aloe vera gel. You want it kind of like more watery and uh, say if you have like the spray tip bottle, then you can uh, add more alcohol to your solution. And there we have a nice good mixture there. take my three ounce travel bottle here and we'll go ahead and pour that so you can either just pour that in there I also have a turkey baster which I use since I make uh, quite a bit of this much it. That's how you make your hand sanitizer. just to get the uh, alcohol to mix with the aloe vera gel a little bit better. And you see that we have our nice aloe vera, aloe vera gel and alcohol and tea tree oil on our hand sanitizer. And with this consistency, it's nice on the skin keeps your skin moisturized and doesn't dry it out from all the alcohol. Feel cleaner already. Well, this is Will Henderson once again. Let me know how you liked the video. Hope that helps you out and uh, stay safe out there.